Lively Nation, on today's episode of Lively TV, I visited the top five most popular casual dining restaurants to see if I could find any dessert options under 400 calories. Welcome to Live Lean TV. I am your host, Brad Guthrie, the number one expert teaching you how to live lean 365 days a year. So most of us, we love dessert. But let's be honest, the idea of dessert is kind of crazy. It's usually a calorie-filled meal after another meal. And most times, the amount of calories in the dessert is actually higher than the main course. But I get it. We like to have something sweet after a meal. Fortunately, as a kid growing up, my family never really ate dessert at home, and we rarely ordered it when we went to restaurants. So I'm not really a big lover of desserts. However, I realize it's a small percentage of you may like desserts. Okay, probably a hell of a lot of you actually like desserts. So does this mean you can't have it while you're eating out? More often than not, I'd say skip the dessert. However, every once in a while, like a cheat meal, a dessert can be enjoyed. But be careful, because they're usually loaded with calories. But with that in mind, I decided to visit the top five most popular casual dining restaurants to see if I could find any dessert options under 400 calories. Do you think I had any luck? Let's find out the top five restaurants and see if they provide any dessert options under 400 calories. Number five, Chili's, nothing. Lowest option was a 750 calorie cheesecake. Yes, 750 calories for your after dinner meal. Yeah, damn. Number four, Red Lobster. Sorry, nothing. Lowest option was a 580 calorie key lime pie. Okay, so that's not as bad as the 750 calorie cheesecake from Chili's, but come on. For some people, 580 calories is one third of the calories they require in a day. All those calories consumed in one piece of pie. Brutal. Number three, Applebee's success. I want you to check out their dessert shooter, the strawberry cheesecake. There's 390 calories, 24 grams of fat, 38 grams of carbohydrates, and six grams of protein. Not the best macronutrient breakdown, but from just a calorie standpoint, it's actually a decent option if you have a sweet tooth. And number two, Olive Garden success. I want you to check out the chocolate mousse cake. It's 370 calories, 21 grams of fat, 42 grams of carbs, and five grams of protein. Also, they provide five options from the Dolcini mini dessert menu. I love the idea of offering smaller desserts. And they also have a kid's sundae as well, so these are all under 400 calories, just big enough to fulfill that sweet tooth, but not big enough in calories to blow you into a fat storing mode. Don't be shy to order from the kids menu. The cool kids are doing it. And number one, IHOP. Yeah, IHOP number one, and it's a success. I want you to check out the ice cream sundae with hot fudge, which has 380 calories, 19 grams of fat, 47 grams of carbs, and six grams of protein, or check out the ice cream sundae with strawberry topping. The best option, 310 calories, 19 grams of fat, 30 grams of carbs, and six grams of protein. So bottom line here, guys, if you need to, order a dessert on occasion, but portion it out. Split it with one person that you're with, order from the kid's menu, or as soon as the waiter puts the dessert on the table, cut it in half and ask them to take the rest and put it away but just don't bring it home. This will help you reduce all temptations. While you're living lean, it's not about depriving ourselves. It's about making smarter choices. Most times after your meal, a nice soothing tea is all you need to fix that sweet tooth craving. Give those tips a try next time you're craving a gut blasting dessert. You can thank me later. And for more daily tips like this, make sure you go over and subscribe to our second YouTube channel, Brad Guthrie TV, as we show you our daily videos of how both Jessica and I live lean, and we show you our home cooked meals, and late night snacks and we actually bring you out to restaurants when we go out to eat as well. You get a behind the scenes look and it's all free. Link to subscribe is in the video description below. And if you enjoyed this episode, make sure you give us the big thumbs up by clicking the like button below and also subscribe to this channel because we upload new episodes every Monday, Wednesday, and Thursday. I want to thank you guys so much for watching and keep living lean. Lively Nation, on today's episode of Lively TV, I'm sharing a simple workout tip on how to smash fat faster.